Welcome back. In the previous video, we discussed why Pagefly is essential for building advanced, fast, and customizable pages without coding. Now let's dive into how to install Pagefly and start transforming your store. Now let's dive into how to install Pagefly and start transforming your store. In this video, I'll show you how to install Pagefly step-by-step -step and provide an overview of the Pagefly dashboard. Firstly, let's start with install Pagefly app to your Shopify store. I will find the app on the Shopify search bar, click on apps, then type Pagefly. You will see the app icon of Pagefly. Click on the app icon. It will link to the installed dashboard of Pagefly on Shopify app store. The other way to find Pagefly app to install is that you can access to Shopify app store, then search Pagefly. After that, choose the Pagefly landing page builder app so now click on the install icon. It will go to the install dashboard in your Shopify store. Continue click on install button. Next, we will turn on the UI optimization. By the way, click on enable UI optimization. UI optimization requires cookies to deliver a better user experience. You can always change this setting later. Now it will have quick navigation to help you start using Pagefly to adapt your requirements. You can choose page to create a new page with Pagefly. You can also choose section to build a section with Pagefly, then can reuse it in your current page, or you can skip this navigation step. Now I will introduce with some overview about Pagefly dashboard. Let's start with the main dashboard of the app. You will see the guideline step-by-step -step here to help you build your page easier. Continue scroll down. You will see some useful information. Quick view your plan here. The support channel, 24-4 live chat that you can chat and get free support 24-7. The help center with a several guideline article about how to use Pagefly. The video channel to help you can see the guideline more visualized. And the community to get new update about our app. Secondly, we move the pages tab. We can create a blank page, create with template or use the import page feature. Next is the section tab. We can also create section with the same option as create a new page I mentioned before. After publish the section, we can use it in your Pagefly page or Shopify page that you created by your Shopify theme. This setting tab will help you connect Pagefly with Google Analytics or to track some metric for your online store. This list the extra function Pagefly provide to help you build your page more flexibility and personalize. Integration is where you can find all third-party apps current integrate with Pagefly. There are also other functions to help you build your page more personalized, such as global slides, option swatches, custom font, media file, and trash to check your deleted files. Finally is the Preferences tab. You will see some apps setting here about account, billing, analytics, user interface, and more. In this video, I've introduced you how to install Pagefly and provided an overview of the Pagefly dashboard. Now it's your turn to start building. Click the link in the description to install Pagefly today. In the next video, we'll dive into understanding the different page types you can create with Pagefly and how to choose the best one for your business. You don't wanna miss it. It is the end of the video tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe for more helpful video